Hi, welcome back to Booster TV. It's Fab Polly here today, and we're going to be talking about Eviation Alice electric aeroplane today. Before we get into today's episode i just want to encourage you to subscribe to bizjet tv if you haven't done so already this channel is all about private aviation and private jets private aircraft how to operate them um, interviews with different owners and why they chose the airplane they have how they use their airplane to build their business uh, lots of information about the different aircraft and what they do how much they cost to run how much they cost to buy how to buy a private jet and all sorts of other interesting information but today let's get into the episode and we're going to be talking about Eviation which is a company from Israel and they've developed an electric airplane yes this is very very interesting it's designed as a commuter airplane but um, I think it can very well be turned, as you can see, the cabin into maybe a six-seater private jet or private aircraft because it has propellers. Um, now, interestingly enough, uh, the airplane is being developed right now and uh, the range is about 650 miles, which is not much, uh, 240 knots. So it's quite slow. Uh, but, you know, if you're doing a short distance, you're covering two, 300 miles, um, there's not going to be much difference uh, on, on such a short, short range whether you're going fast or not because you know airplanes have to uh, fly at 250 knots below 10,000 feet anyway so you know this flies at 240 knots so this is good for short hops uh, the interesting thing is the aircraft is going to cost four million dollars to buy which is not much and it's going to cost believe it or not just 200 dollars an hour to operate so that's a lot lower than you know its competitors out there which cost around about you know 12 to 1400 dollars an hour so, you know, $4 million to buy it, and then it's just $200 an hour to run. And of course, it's not going to pollute the air like conventional airplanes do. So this is an interesting one. Obviously, it's not out yet. It's uh, They're building the first prototype. They're going to start flight testing. And the, uh, the goal is to launch and deliver the first aircraft in 2022. So it's not too far away. So this is definitely one to keep your eye on. Um, there are other projects out there which are similar. So I'm sure we're going to be seeing more and more electric aircraft come onto the market in the next few years. Uh, the challenge right now is the, the, the battery. Uh, this airplane, for example, is restricted to 30,000 feet. And that's a lot to do with the battery. I mean, the, the, the fact that it's only got 650 mile range and the fact that it's limited to 30,000 feet, because of course, higher up you go, colder it is. And so the battery needs to be able to function at lower temperatures. And then of course, you need to increase the endurance. So the battery needs to have more life on it um, and more charge in order to go further afield. But, you know, technologists and, and scientists and engineers are working away at this. And so no doubt we will see uh, this change. Uh, Elon Musk has said more than once that he's working on a electric vertical takeoff and landing hypersonic airplane. So that would be interesting, taking off and landing vertically, which this Alice um, aviation airplane does not do. It lands and takes off like a conventional airplane. But, you know, 650 mile range, 240 knots at $200 an hour is definitely one to look at and I'm sure there's a market for it. Uh, the company's already received a number of orders from some commuter airlines, but I definitely see a market for this in the private jet world too. So if you're thinking about buying a private jet or a private aircraft, or you want to look into this, uh, this type of uh, aircraft for the future, it's definitely one to look at. I will be covering uh, more developments on the Alice Avi Aviation Alice aircraft in the next uh, uh, few years, or months, of BizJet TV and so you know keep watching us and it will keep you updated on the situation but right, if you haven't subscribed to this channel I encourage you to subscribe and post your comments below share this video like this video and that's all from Fab Pollock BizJet TV and I'll see you on the next one